Mr. Mayor, in campaigning for the lesbian and gay vote in an election year, a bit of historical context is necessary in dealing with the AIDS crisis in New York City. It wasn't until 1983 that you met with people to deal with the AIDS crisis. How do you respond to these criticisms? That is uh, falsehood. Please, anybody who's, who's thinking about being arrested, fill out a support sheet. Make sure that your support person knows who you are and what group you're in. Yeah. Um, if we end up in the tombs, is there a, like a queer tank there? And would you recommend that we ask to be there? There is a homo tank, and I've been there, and it's better than the straight tank, let me tell you. Uh, who else? Yes. Yeah. In the past, you've described ACT UP as fascist. Yeah, in the press release, you called them concerned citizens. And uh, I was wondering what changed your mind. I, I don't think that uh, you, you uh, can't use both. Uh, fascists can be concerned citizens. <laughs> Um, and um, I don't believe they are fascists. I think they have used a fascist tactic. Let us celebrate together tonight the end of the last day on which Ed Koch can tell himself that the communities which are being decimated by this epidemic are so weak and so divided among themselves that he can keep serving us this kind of bullshit. <laughs> Tomorrow morning he will begin to learn the truth. <laughs> Talking to Jim Igo for the Treatment Issues Committee of ACT UP. Jim, what specific treatment issues are being brought into this demonstration this week? The municipal hospitals are totally falling apart. More than half the people who get diagnosed with AIDS today get diagnosed in the emergency rooms of our city. You're going to find yourself waiting four days in an emergency room before you get a bed. I'm pretty scared, but uh, being HIV positive, I don't have much choice in that. I just love all these people, and I think that what we're doing is really right. And I mean, listen to this, and look at all the people. It's just really wonderful, and it's worth putting myself on the line. There is no accurate diagnosis. There are incentives in the city hospitals not to diagnose people with AIDS, and therefore people don't get treated. We are angry at the way this city has handled this crisis, and we demand that Ed Koch exert leadership and declare a state of emergency. Go in the street now or wait. Those are the options. One. He says go. He says now. Three. Tom. Go now, Tom. Says. We're standing here with Larry Kramer. What is ACT UP trying to say today to Ed Koch? We're sending a message to public officials, to closeted public officials, that we won't be shot on anymore, and obviously all the AIDS issues. I would love to see like more cameras or something, you know, for our own protection. Can everyone hear his concern. People die every day. Friends get sick every day. I don't. It's like being in the trenches. And there is such anger in the community, and it, it is coalescing in a way that has never been done before. Okay, which way do we face, girlfriends? This way or that way? I'll be back
Time to lose.